Alright, and we're back with more Witcher 3. So, last time we ended up uh, winning against a whole entire Gwent tournament, and that was pretty great. Unfortunately, we did not get the whole 9,000 gold, or 9,000 crowns, as I would have liked to have. But whatever. Now we can just go on and uh, find Siggy Ruba's treasure, whatever it leads to around here, and do what we need to do. Finally get out of Novigrad because this whole place is just constantly cross Basically this whole place is just constantly causing me to crash and I hate it. I absolutely hate it. I have to constantly just turn off the game, turn it back on, turn it off, turn it on, and it's just just ugh. Ugh, it's really taking its toll on my patience here. Ugh. Let's just Triss could not help Geralt. Yet she did direct him to oh. play game Tilly. I think that this game would be a lot more bearable in terms of actually playing it if I didn't have to watch the introduction every single time I start it back up. I wonder if there's a way to turn that off. Very long loading screen, I gotta be honest here. Been sitting here for quite some time. Oh, finally. Oh, where am I? Alright, so one thing that I definitely wanted to do... Wow, I have that much? Oh, apparently I already have it. Uh... Alright, so, Siggy Reuven's treasure. Search Margrave... I have whatever the hell's name. Uh, Margrave Henkel's house using your rabbit senses. Okay. Oh. Knock, knock! Go back to Quinn. Crystallized. That's footprints. Yes. Wow. Footprints. Hmm. He also left in quite the hurry and took everything with him. Silver cylinder. Bottom looks like what I found in the sewer. Dandelion, you better not have had a hand in this. Maybe that's what the dream was. Weird. Also, one thing I definitely realized. So, during that succubus uh, quest. You know, dead. Oh, deadly delights. Yeah, the guards, they died. But here's the thing. Perhaps they died willingly. Because if you think about it, how did they die? Yeah, they died. What looks like dried out corpses. So that means they were literally given death by Snoo Snoo. These are things. A letter and a bottle. The wine from your birth year. It's absolutely excellent. Startling bouquet. You absolutely must try it. But afterwards, please place the bottle back where you found it. With love from thee. So I would assume... Well, thankfully I didn't have to the actually... Year. Could be dandelions or series. Uh, wow, I wonder where to put it. Twelve forty five to twelve fifty four. Hmm, <laughs> satisfying click in the next room over, I think. Man, I really wish that things could actually work like this in real life. I would love to have a house that's filled with riddles. Only to have a great big treasure at the end of it, but it turns out the treasure Secret at the end. Room. Probably where Dandelion and his cohorts planned the heist. Mm. Wild stain. Wyvern oil. Yeah, let's not let him know. Uh... Sugar, and lumps of a substance dipped in wyvern oil. Hmm. Potassium? Looks like they made the bomb here. A Nilf Guardian sword? What's in here? Something I've already read. From Doodoo. Letter from Doodoo! Siri, Menge is following me. He has seized the treasure. He has Dandelion. You must flee. Footsteps. Not good. Instructions on how to build a bomb. 
Signed by one Kalkstein. Well, I should probably take that. Check what's going on downstairs. Okay. Dijkstra and Triss. Didn't expect to see you here. Certainly not with Triss. I decided we could use someone who knows a bit of magic. The runes on the bomb. I'm absolutely dying to know what they mean. You dying to know too, Triss? No, just here for the coin. Cool. Ah, Marigold playing the cynical materialist. I love it. In truth, her ideals brought Triss here. She needs gold to save her colleagues. When I recover my treasure, I'll be in a position to help her. Simple as that. Speaking of which, and pardon my Beauchelet was, have you found out who fucking nicked my gold? Sorry, I was cleaning off my glasses there. Okay, so wait, why'd you come here? Hang on. Gotta tell me why you're here first. We agreed. If I learned anything, I'd take it to you. So we did. But I was concerned about you. Stopped by to see if everything was alright. No, you didn't. You don't trust me. Bullshit. You don't trust me. I trust you as much as you trust me. Not at all. Believe me, it's a healthy relationship. <laughs> Gentlemen, really feel privileged to witness your battle of wits. But try to remember, unlike you, I put my life at risk every time I venture out into the streets. Did the same just coming here. So I beg you, can we get to the point? I wonder what happens if I say the other thing. Hang on. Thanks, really. Thanks. You can breathe easy now. In the future, though, remember this. I can look after myself. Fine. You look after yourself, and I'll look after my interests. Gentlemen, really feel privileged to witness your- But try to remember- Okay, she just says the same thing. Okay, all signs point to Mangle. Bothered Triss for nothing. No point examining the bomb. Because? Because I already know who nabbed your treasure. Commander of the Temple Guard, Caleb Menge. <laughs> well, well, Marigold. Your coin stands to come with a side of revenge. Geralt, would you be kind enough Rabbit. to tell me what you've learned? I'm terribly curious. Margrave Henkel told me everything. Henkel told me. Old man's alive and well. Faked his own death to escape his creditors. Strange. I had no idea he was in debt. He was. And Menga promised to take care of things in exchange for help with the heist. So... Geralt, how can I put this delicately? Bollocks. If you thought I'd fall for that tale you just pulled out of your ass, you don't know me one bit. I know you. You care about the results. Know you well enough to know what matters. Results. So I lied. Still say I can lead you to your treasure. Forgive me, Geralt, but after what you just pulled, I'd sooner believe a whore who proclaimed her undying love. Would you believe a sorceress who stands to gain if you get your coin back? Perhaps. I'd still prefer the whore, though. Hey! You're what? hiding something. And that's one thing I can't stand. Even more than Nilfgaard. But ultimately, this is a business deal, not a marriage. Besides, there must be some truth in all those lies. You're too dense to make it all up on your own. Sure, believe mm. that all you Menger's want. Menger's been spending heaps of coin lately. Though, to my knowledge, he shouldn't have a copper to his name. So, what now? From what I've heard, Menger spends his nights at the docks, witch hunter's quarters. Maybe pay him a visit. Ask where he's holding my gold for me. While well, you sit here twiddling your thumbs. Mm -hmm. So we do your dirty work while you sit around twiddling your thumbs. Darling, when I'm able to make use of someone, I always do. It's convenient. And safe. Come on, admit you're scared of Menger. Of course I'm scared. Bloody dangerous horse, son. Triss would concur, I think. Not in those words. But I do agree with the statement overall. I'm gonna be honest here. These guys in the background look real busy. They're just yawning and they're being like, mm, uh, mm, uh. What are they even... Why did you even bring them? They're not even doing anything. They're just standing around and yawning. I doubt Menga will say anything willingly. Doubt Menga will admit anything willingly. As do I. Lucky I hired a witcher and a sorceress who've been through so much together to get this done. Oh, What's our boy. past got to do with it? A great deal. Lovers will jump into the abyss for one another. Suits my needs perfectly. 
Namely, it greatly increases your chances of getting out of the hunter's barracks alive with my treasure. You expect us to basically pull out 20 tons of gold from there? You have got some unrealistic expectations there, mister. You're using us. In other words, you're using us. Using you? Never. Merely making the most of your mutual bond. <laughs> well, lovebirds, I really must be going. Good luck. Yeah, you really count on it. Thought you'd correct him. Say that we... You know. No. Nah. No. Nah. Uh, you didn't say anything either. Could have corrected him yourself. True. But it's not an easy thing to say, is it? But we've strayed from our topic. Got a treasure to recover. Trish, yes, we do. I'll tell you something. Dijkstra's gold, it's the last thing I care about. Thought as much. This is about Siri, isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Menga's got Dandelion locked up somewhere, and Dandelion saw Siri. That changes everything. Listen, meet me at midnight by the Chapel of the Eternal Fire, east of the harbor. We'll figure out a way to get into the Hunter's Barracks together. All right. See you then, and thanks. It's interesting to see that no one actually... Where are you going? That's a wall trip. Okay. That that answers my question. So. Alright, Mitris at the Eternal good. Fire Shrine. Yeah, you over at midnight. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, also, there's supposed to be some stuff over there. Well, it's not even close to midnight. And I suppose I should just go to the north. Apparently, there's supposed to be some stuff over there. Also, one thing that I must have forgotten. Uh, let's see here. Where is it? Quests. Treasure hunts. Uh, let's see. Novigrad. Okay. Under Temple Isle. And we got another one in Novigrad. A third one in Novigrad. But I don't want to do that because that one, uh, yeah. It's... All right. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shush. Okay. So I really have to go to Temple Isle. I'll be there soon, Triss. Don't worry, I'm I'm just I'm doing treasure stuff. I need treasure. Well, this is a really nice place. I also like that up there. Doublets off to the latest fashion. Get them here Time and only here. They look new Can you? The fashion has come from the south. Oh, well I guess he doesn't sell me anything. Boo! State your origin. Balance. Wars on there, sir. Velen's a hive of witchcraft and superstition. Remember, we catch you engaging in black magic, you'll be interrogated and tried. Me? Black magic, sir? I'm a simple lumberjack. Then I don't know what you seek in this city. We've no need for loggers. That uh, you might <laughs> want to, uh... You might want to rethink that course of action there, considering that you actually do need, uh... loggers. Because who's going to cut the lo- I mean, where are you going to get wood? Is it just going to appear out of thin air? No. Oh. oh, hello. Do you wish the eternal fire's blessing upon you and your household? Come, true believer. May its light shine- Oh, Watch shut up! see the shine of my sword. And back off. That incense is making me nauseous. You might have said so right away. Countersign. And fish soup gives the deacon's auntie a headache. What do you need? Before you ask, I'm all out of hemorrhoid cream. <laughs> what are you talking about? Your incense that bad for the brain? What do you mean? You gave the password, signaling you wish to buy some herbs. Uh... <laughs> this is subterfuge. What's this about? You're about as much a priest of the eternal fire as I am a vestal virgin. What sort of conspiracy is this? Conspiracy? Damn. Folks eat conspiracies everywhere. I sell harmless things. Yet in turbulent times like these... Think it's safer to don priest's robes? See, thing is, in this town, impersonating a priest is likely grounds for punishment. Cruel and unusual, I'd wager. I impersonate no one. I am a priest. Though I am also an alchemist. Sadly, it's become difficult to reconcile the two. Uh, right. will you report me? 
or shall we make a deal? Trying to bribe me? Save your coin. I'm not fond of priests. In fact, you'd have to pay me to talk to them. <laughs> then I shall sell you my wares for less. Cast your eyes. See if there's aught you could use. Provided, of course, you do not seek hemorrhoid cream. I do not seek hemorrhoid cream. <gasps> a game of cards. Show me your goods first. Show me what you have in stock. I don't really think that... Ooh. The Cult of Freya. I'll take that. Okay, what you got here? Sharing a bog, rune stone, greater rune, greater rune, greater rune. Wow, you got a lot of greater runes here. Uh, I don't really think I want to blow out thousands of gold for all these. So, with that in mind, just show me... Oh, play me. Go play me. Let's play cards. Gwent wouldn't be bad. That's right. Also, didn't I get a bunch of stuff from the tournament? Uh, let's see here. Uh, no. And I only have about one, two, three, four poor infantry. So, I guess with that in mind, let's go! Okay, I got one spy card. Toss this trebuchet. Keep the catapult, but toss Vesemir. Why are you in the guard? Damn it! A death mold. Why would you do that? Toss out a vest, death mold. Oh, you dick! Wait, this actually works in my favor. Because if I do this. It's probably going to scorch it, though. Because everyone just seems to have a f scorch card around here, and I hate it. Okay, pass. Wow. Well, I guess I could just, could just throw out all of these, uh, let's see here. Um... Weakest spy card. There. <laughs> well, we got a pretty good chance for Deekstra to pop up here. Uh, so let's toss him out. Come on, spy card! Are you... F I honestly hate this. I hate it so much. Wait, no. Yeah. You got a lot of type out. Well, he's useless now, but I might as well toss him out anyway. Woo! He's probably gonna commander's horn that. Yeah, there's the doot doot. Jeez! Take him. Ah, uh, yeah, he's screwed. Well, I don't even need to anymore, so... As fun as the overkill is, I don't really need to do it this time. Philippa Eilhart? Oh, wow! Wow! 
let's go ahead and toss, uh, well, Kiramets, you've been pretty great and all, but, uh, I gotta get rid of you. You do nothing. Okay, so there's something over there. I'm supposed to be looking for these things so I can stop worrying about it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why? That makes too many. Why would you guys have this? There's no fence around here. Unless it's supposed to be like that. Okay, so apparently that's death if I move. Oh, wait. So what you're telling me is that I have to... Okay, so basically I would have to find a way to go down. So then what's over here? Okay, people look busy over here. Ah! Can I light this? Oh look people, the eternal fire has... It has come up with me. Right here. Pardon me. It must be a sign. Me. Worship me. Now. Okay, so there's something over there. Oh, my frame rate. Ah ha ha! You've gained one ability point. Wow. That's a pretty nice view. Unfortunately, it's basically destroying my frame rate, so I gotta get out of here. We gotta find a way to get down there. Which, I think I do know a way... Well, we gotta get down without dying, that is. But first... Hmm, free stuff. So we can't. We took the fast travel point, and then we just came down here to go ahead and. Thankfully, there's a boat down here. So, oh shut up, drowners. Let's go ahead and see what's down there. Man, I really wish I packed a lunch for this. God, it's so boring. I gotta say, there are a lot of herbs down there in the water. All right, we're going in. Oh. Wait, so then, where is the, uh... Explore the passages under Temple Isle. So how the hell do I get there? Beep, beep. Backing up my boat here. Oh, okay, I see. Maybe there's a passageway. Okay, so I see that right there, but the question is, how the hell do I get up there? Hey, look, a boat. Okay, so the game still hasn't answered my... Oh, okay, okay. I see how to get up there now. Damn it! Pam, param, pam, pam, param. I really don't like them singing that Pam Param song. It sounds horrible. Oh. Move! Ooh, Move! It even sounds proud. Oh, okay. Here's how you do it. That's how you get down over here. Right? Or am I mistaken? Uh. No, 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 no! I think I missed it. I don't know. Oh, wait, maybe I didn't miss it. No, no, no! Wow. Alright. Now then. There's some kind of illusory thing. It says it's right below me. So, I guess... Ah! ah! No! Oh, come on! <sighs> now I have to deal with this again. Maybe it's actually inside of the church. Which would make sense. Or whatever this is. Locked. Hmm. Maybe this will be the pathway to it. Not I don't know. Oh, I wish my man were as brave as you. Any well, thank you. Monsters, 
You know, it gets really hard to find the way to these things when you can't even look down. Or can I? Okay, walk. Yes, walk. Whee. Okay, so I'm supposed to just do this, apparently. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Okay. Where is it? Oh, come the f- Oh, this is actually getting frustrating to actually look for it. Another try, here we go. Okay, so I'm guessing I have to fall off here. No! Okay, we found out where now, hopefully. Oh, okay, so there's supposed to be a lower area for me to go to. Alright, so from what I can see, this is the way to go. Whee! Hopefully this is it. Because honestly, I am I am just absolutely... Do oh! Oh, finally! An illusion. So this is the illusion that I was... Oh, okay. Shh! Can I not dispel this part of the illusion? Okay, well, whatever, so long as I'm through. Oh, there seems to be something in here, so that means, uh, where's the cat potion? Cat, 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 cat. Let's just put this up. Because why not? Oh, a golem, you say? Well... Prepare to die. Man, you're weak. Come on. Ow, 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 ow. Not that, not that. Alright. Monster Golem's Heart. Ooh. Put that up, because why not? Let's see what's around here. Nice looking area. So they built this on top of an elven ruin? What's this? I take it whatever is up, it would be up here, probably. Open up! Key required? What? Well, I guess if it needs a key, then I guess the only way that we can get the key is probably over here, where the second passage is. So, I would assume it's over here. Why is that smoking? Eh, <laughs> 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 God. Eat some fruit after that journey. Oh. Whew. Okay. What's this? Read it. Look to the depths to be lifted up. Yeah. Light this up. Oh, uh, okay. Okay, we got a note here. Research notes. As per the instructions of your supervisor, Irenius Versteingard, we have conducted a series of studies on the gener gen genotype of the creatures commonly known as drowners. Sadly, administering a poison made of fugu fish induced a coma in the specimen in the study. 24 hours and cease prohibiting us from continuing the study. Cool. Hmm. Strange. Didn't think I would have to do all this.
Why is there a wraith? Weird. I assume this has got to be some kind of riddle. As for this, what's this? Mysterious recipe. Dear Pascal and Timo, pumpkin, chicken thighs, or alternative mix of exotic spices, milk of the cocoa, Nucifer. You owe me now. Okay. What's this do? I guess I gotta make them all face the lift? Oh, I see. Okay, look to the depths. Meaning make them all look to the depths. Uh, if that's... Okay. Use it! Oh, here we go. Well, this looks wonderful. Whee! Oh, this is what I love. There. Little bastards. Is there another drowner in here? It better not be. What's this? Laboratory key. Cool. Better not be another drowning around here. I'll beat him. Here we go. Finally, we can open up this door. Unlocked. Oh. It says it's a laboratory. No good. No evil. Only pain. No good. No evil. Only pain. Okay. Hey! Shut up and fight. Hey! Moonblade? Laboratory notebook. Day one. Luckily, the teleporter des deposited this directly in my laboratory. It's good to be home. I had grown sick of the gills of that leaky tub. Oh, I've grown sick to the. Okay. Oh, good lord. Well, let's see. Well, at least we got the armor. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Wasn't there another one around here somewhere? Find the silver sword upgrade. Okay. Oh, it says it's way over there. Hey, wait a minute. What's this? I almost missed this. Oh, the game almost, okay. You almost had me, game. You almost had me. Let's see. Garbage. So then wait, where does this lead?
Whoa, 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 whoa. Another chest. With a note. Invoice for our golem. Issued by Jehuda Lu, purchaser, Arunus Versteingard. Goods purchased. Guardian Golem, clay, porcelain. Warranty. In the event of damage to the ceramic, please report immediately to the nearest branch of Jehuda Lu and Princesses. The golem can only be serviced by qualified company personnel. Okay. What's this? Stuff. <coughs> Stop. Hey! Oh, it's, it's, it's 6 p.m. We gotta go back to Triss. We gotta get back to Triss. We gotta get back to Triss. Well, maybe after a quick uh, route around for that silver sword upgrade. Who knows? Maybe we'll find something of use. Well, actually, I just thought of something. How the hell am I supposed to get back out? <laughs> oh, maybe that's how. Or wait, maybe I can get back up this way. Hey, look, a door. That's locked. Boo! How am I supposed to rob people if their houses are locked? Oh, it's 9 to... So wait, fast travel ain't really fast travel. So then it should be back here, right? Eh? Why are you even here? Same reason anyone comes here. Play a bit, have a good time. Invite only, mate. Shit out of luck. <laughs> uh, I think you'll let me in anyway. I think you're about to let me in. By all means, please. And you, wish me luck. Luck be with you at the tables. <laughs> I just need to play one more time. Wait, so then how the hell do I get the silver sword? Oh, it's gotta be back here. Wait, so then where do I go? Hmm. Might want to look around some. Oh, okay. <laughs> so this has to be it. Oh, that's a candle. So where is it? Maybe that's got to be it. Yeah. <laughs> And just because Ugh, tis a dog's life. All right, well, as much as we'd love to screw around with uh, these people, we really don't want to. We gotta go find Triss because it's almost midnight. So, oh, it's way over there. Well, I guess if we leg it, we can probably get over there quick. All right, so we're gonna do a quick save and then restart the game here. So, I'll be right back. And we fix it for you? No. Said I'd come to the wrong place. That he sell dumplings now. Jonas swore it was Hattori's handiwork, and with a warranty. What a prick! Wow. Okay, well, I guess since she's not here, we're gonna have to wait until midnight then. Oh. Okay. Glad you're here. Listen. Took a look at the building, and it does not look good. How? Mean it could use a bit of paint and spackle. I mean, it's a damned fortress. High walls, guards at the gate, armed men everywhere. We could never sneak in, and fighting our way in won't work. Menga would have had plenty of time to escape. What do you suggest? Well... Oh. Take these shackles. Put them on me. Oh my. <laughs> uh, Triss, sure about this here now? Uh, Triss, sure you want to do this? Out here, with everyone watching? 
This might come as a surprise to you, but shackles do have uses outside of the bedroom. Hey. Bring the hunters the vile Triss Marigold. They won't just open the gate for you. They're likely to let you present her to Menga personally. No way. Too risky. It is. Dandelion's life's on the line. So? Series two. No Whoa. such thing as too risky. Well, I mean, when Siri's life is on the line, then it then it's not too risky. But when it comes down to Dandelion, I mean, that guy's been lying about me. You know, oh, I I, I wrote songs and I inspired him with them. And I did this and that for him. Like, no, you didn't, you little... You know what? Actually, no. I want to free him now, just so I can punch him in the face a few times. Really want to do this? Triss, think about it. Really want to walk into the lion's den of your own free will and in chains? Yes. Oh. No, can't allow it. Nice of you to worry, but I've made my decision, and I won't change it. Alright, but what then? Fine. Let's say they take the bait. What then? We go in, I put a sword to Menga's throat and ask him where Dandelion is? Might not work. Menga's scum, but you have to admit, death doesn't scare him. Always found no, but I can. fanatics. So we gotta trick him into talking. Any ideas? Uh, maybe tell him you have information about the Lodge. Or about Philippa. Even better, he hates her most of all. You'll think of something. I always do. So, I uh, wait, I wanted to thank wait. you. About I something. Wanna thank you. Come on. Anyone would do this. No. Not anyone. Stop. It doesn't befit a sorceress to blush. Yes, it does. Actually, come to think of it, options. I guess I can't find the option to. I guess I have to do it outside of the game, but I was looking for the option to put her into the other costume. That apparently was made. Uh, so apparently there used to be a Witcher MOBA game. But that basically just was very terribly, uh, yeah. What about the treasure? What about the treasure? If we learn anything, great. If not... Thought you need coin from Dijkstra to help the other mages. True, I do. Lots of ways to get gold, though. It's just not the most important thing now. Well, let's go then. Still got a bad feeling about this, but tough. Let's go. Whoosh. Bill, remember, I can Rabbit. take care of myself. What are you talking about? The hunters. They won't treat me like a lady, but I'll survive. Might hurt a bit, but... Siri, she's what matters. Do what you need to do, no matter what happens. Can't promise uh, that. Yeah, I really can't. To, all right? Whoa, okay then. Jeez, mm. fine. All right. What's that noise? Knock, knock. What do you want? Here for my reward. For the Alpha. For a witch. Recognize who I got? It's Triss Marigold. Marigold? Wow, he took the hood down quick. Come in then. Look at this douchebag. Well, well. Triss Merigold. Giving up drowners for sorceresses. Pays well, first them. off... Oh. It's cause they do more harm. What's a drowner do? Pull the odd fisherman from his boat. But the witches... They murder kings. Scheme. Start wars. Don't forget turning your cow's milk sour straight out of the udder. You're oh. done jesting, Merigold. For good. Excuse you. Soul. Mm, I want to talk to Menga. Not so fast. I hand her over to Menga himself, or not at all. You reckon we don't know what to do with this witch? Well, no. Go, you bastard! 
Volga told what he's acting? got no place being in such a pretty mouth. I guess we'll have to rip it out. You know, these two are real tempting to say, but we're here to get some information. So I guess we'll just have to go along with it. At the same time, screw these guys. But whatever, got us something off for Manga. Try to loosen it if I were you. Might learn something interesting. For instance? For instance, where Philippa Eilhart's hiding. I'll get you for this, you- Shut your gob, ginger whore! And you spit it out! Where's Eilhart? I don't know. I, I mean, uh, to I'll tell your boss, no one else. Yeah. Thought I made myself clear. I'll only talk to Menga. Menga don't talk to the likes of you. Well, well then you will be now. Sure to tell him I came by with my friend Marigold. Fine, grab her and come with me, but be sure to stay right close. Oh, fine. Does this mean I can't loot this place? Because I would love to. Did I just see an explosive barrel on the right? Just hang. And is that another one? We. Ooh. Don't we? Here's where we split up. Go see Menga. Marigold will be next door. You can't have her until I get. You don't set the terms here. Dirk, you know what to do. You won't get away. What kind of name is Dirk? Not you, not him. Oh, play it tough, eh? Just you wait. We'll take a fingernail or three. That ought to get you singing. Mm. Oof. Uh, this is real tough to choose because it's like, you know, I don't want them torturing her, but at the same time, I can't really attack them. But fine, take her. Do what you want. Come on, witch. Show you the wonders a pair of pliers can work. You'd be surprised. Well, I I don't understand what what are the skeletons supposed to mean. I believe I told you not to let anyone in unless they had information concerning Philippa Eilhart. This witcher says it's Rabbit. not just that. Anyone can climb that. We'll start with your pinky nail. Nah. Let's go for your ring finger. Ooh. This little piggy went to market. Wee. But it's not that easy to bring us Triss Merigold. Is that who I hear? Very well. I'll go see her shortly. You know, for someone who robbed the treasure, talk. Sit. you would think Sit. that they could afford a roof that isn't leaking. Have a drink, Witcher. Rabbit. Hmm. I mean, I don't see why not. Sure. Let's get a little bit of a drink in there. Sidarian. A twelve sixty one vintage, year of the massacre of Sintra. Eh? Stop squirming. <laughs> this little piggy went home. <laughs> Kurt, please see why Miss Merigold squeals so convincingly. Perhaps she needs something. Hot irons, for instance. Speaking of metal, yep. this goblet's silver. Making sure I'm not a Doppler. Ah, oh, it's immediately apparent. A professional. Well, yes. I find that refreshing. But to answer your question, one can never be too careful. You'd be surprised how many come here turn to rancid jelly as soon as they grip the goblet. What do you mean? Was it poison or something? I mean, did you try and poison me? I mean, I get that the, the you know, silver is basically the weakness of monsters around here, but... Mm. So, got a silver sword in my back. Not enough. Your hunters are torturing Triss, but I haven't been paid. Mm. No other way? I mean... But I haven't been paid. 
Still haven't paid me for the witch, yet your hunters are already torturing her. What of it? You're damaging goods you haven't paid for yet. This little piggy had roast beef. Keep it together, man. Keep it together. This little piggy had none. Don't worry, you shan't leave empty-handed. I shall pay you twice the usual reward for Merigold. Awfully generous. Why? Well, you've turned in your lover. Hey. The emotional trauma it must entail. You deserve compensation. I mean, we rabbits do it. I mean, well, I mean, she didn't really contract. I mean, she didn't really correct me over at the uh, where Deekstra was talking. Uh, I want to say rabbits do anything. I can't really say number four, so basically leaving you with one or three. Uh, screw it. I mean, we rabbits do anything for gold. Yeah, I've plowed Triss. But wow. what does it matter if you're paying gold for her head? Oh yeah. <laughs> Nearly forgot the mutation strip witches of feelings. Rabbits. No. No more. I can't. Be brave, dear. Just one more fingernail and we'll move on to the other hand. This little piggy went wee wee wee. Go! Oh, bitch bit me. <laughs> oh, the bitch bites. Let's put a collar on it. Hey, hey, that's my job. Meritium ought to calm her down. You surprise me. Grab it. Perhaps we can deal after all. So, you know something about Philippa, but I wager you won't share this information for free. What do you want in return? I'm, I'm, I mean... I'm very questionable as to why this one's not in, like, that yellowy colors, like in white, so I assume it must be some kind of dialogue or something. So I'm looking for this treasure. I'm looking for a treasure. With Siggy Ruven's until recently. Well, well. Furthering the cause of the eternal fire on the one end, working for criminals on the other. I work for whoever pays me. Like a whore. More Excuse you? Just offer a different range of services. Where's the treasure? Secure in a Kaviri bank. Far and safe from you. Far and safe from Ruvin. Got information about Philippa. Thought you might want to buy it. I do. But not at any price. Okay, fine. I mean, free my friend Dandelion then. Screw right. you. So free Dandelion. <laughs> First you ask about a criminal's treasure. Now you want me to let loose a blaspheming degenerate. And here I add you for a That's man. only so I can punch him that in the face. A being of some moral principle. No doubt we're cut from different cloth, but we don't have to agree on everything to make a deal. Yeah, we no kidding. We not agree any terms either. What do you mean? I could simply force you to tell me what you know about Philippa. Oh, try it. I doubt that. I really doubt that. Whereas I'm a man of great faith. Oh, pfft. Like that's gonna save you. Guards, in here! Yeah, this is a lot. Get your asses over here. Ow. Alive. Take him alive. Die. Manga. Uh oh. <laughs> I'll take you all on. Back off. I'll take you on. Come on. Uh, Inky. Finally. Give you a taste of your own eternal fire. Oh. There. Really? Another one? Chris, you play on helping out. 
Or are you planning on just doing that? Are they coming over here? I kind of want to let Earth just have at him. Well done. All right. I think that's all of them. That was close. What happened? I thought Menga took the bait. He did. Until I mean, I asked about the treasure. Geralt, we talked this over. Rabbit. You agreed. Uh, fine. Never mind. Hey, I wanted we to know where the office. Maybe we can find some documents mentioning Dandelion. Okay. I'll search his body. You search the room. Fine. Let's start with the desk. Uh, you search his body? Oh, hell no. You mean I'll search his Gildorf sword? <laughs> a daughter of uh, a doll? Well, thank God he had a dolly in here, because I always knew he was a little bitch. Alright, we did a quick route around here. I'm pretty sure there's going to be some stuff on the outside, but I don't really care. She said, search the desk, so search... The and I wonder, what what could possibly be here, considering it's sparkly? There to Caleb Manga. Manga's holy tomb. New instructions regarding the organization of the next execution. If you're ready to meet, place your holy tome in the drop box. In the column of the eternal fire altar, southwest corner, some bits, blah, blah, blah. blah. What about this? Okay. Ew. Ew. Find anything? Just his office key in his pockets. Here. Nothing under his belt. Why are you looking there? Oh, something sewn in the lining. What is it? What? The key to a vault. Oh? Here. Give it to Dijkstra with my regards. Well, I mean... found a letter from a spy. I found a letter to Menga from someone important. A spy, I think. A spy? Take a look. Drop boxes, secret signals. Yeah, strong stench of spycraft here. This agent could know more about Dandelion. Bet he does. Letter explains how to signal for a meeting. No mention of where it would take place. Maybe Dijkstra can help. He knows everything. Everything? Slight exaggeration there. I'm not so <laughs> sure. I mean, he doesn't know everything. I mean, he didn't know where his treasure was, so really. You know, kind of doubt the key will be enough. Key to a vault? No address? Why do I doubt this will make Dijkstra smile? Well, or, might keep him from setting his thugs on us. Did her hands breaking just... Breaking our legs for failing to fulfill our part of the bargain. Meaning glass is half full? Of something strong, I hope. Well, let's get going. All right. Nothing left for us here. Let's go. Be glad to. Just oh. not by way of the main gate. Well, where are we going? I assume this is probably the way out. No, get. We. Huh. Any boxes to loot around here? Oh. This is where we split up. But first, let's burn this shack down. Really? Agreed. We've left too much evidence. Yeah, but I also need to blow off some steam. Listen, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about. But not here, and definitely not now. Come by later okay. when you have a moment? Sure. I'd appreciate it. All right. Let's we do need it. To get out of here. Okay. Find a way out. Gee. Oh. Well, I don't know what she's planning to do, but... I assume it's got to be up here, since it seems to be built for a back exit. Or is it? Oh, I think my frame rate just dropped. Okay. Tell 
teach her what you learned. Okay. Wait a minute. So you're telling me this was an option this whole entire time? Oh. You there, Mr. Roven wants a word. Why? Impatient old bastard. What? Huh? <laughs> Nothing. Be there soon. Who do I spy? Why, it's get Rabbit of Rivia. <sighs> will you stop following me already? I will. Soon as you tell me where my treasure is. Me and Menga didn't see eye to eye. How badly? Well, you badly. see the whole thing burning. I suppose that explains the smoke. My treasure's not in there, is it? Burning with the witch hunters. I would hope not. No. Your gold's in a Kaviri bank. Here's the key to the vault that holds it. <laughs> well, well. Would have earned yourself a medal if I was in a position to bestow it. What do you mean? <laughs> That's it? No witticism in parting? <laughs> That's all you're gonna say? No wry remark. No scintillating joke. <laughs> you want a knee slapper? Fine, I'll tell you one. Ready? Sure. You lied to me. Again. What? what do you mean? You knew from the start who robbed me, but you didn't deign to share that information with me. <laughs> Stop crying, you'll get your treasure back. No, you? I didn't. But I did deign to help you find your treasure. So stop moaning. I jest you not get it. Who's walking you in the water? My trust. I can live with that. This time, yes, you'll live. And now, time to settle things. That a threat? Quite the contrary. You helped me, which Rabbit. So in spite of everything, you've earned your reward. I take it you've still no idea what happened to Dandelion? None. Found someone well. who might know, though. A spy, I guess. Signs his name, Yammerlack. Found a letter of his. Just one problem. It only details how to arrange a meeting with him. Makes no mention of where. A ruined house in far corners. Give the signal, and he'll show up there the same day, just before midnight. Oh. Wait. Yeah, how do you know this? Probably shouldn't ask, but... Dijkstra, how the hell do you know all this? I draw it all from the flight patterns of birds. Your wow. Sarcasm. It gets tiring, you know? I have far worse qualities than that, believe me. And a final humble plea. Don't try to fool me again. Ever. How about don't piss me off, you oh, raging man, baby? Dijkstra's nobleman? Oh, uh, yep. Okay. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Alright, we're back. We're back. We're back. Fine. Good folk. What's with you? Well, I don't know. Maybe people don't want to actually put it out because these guys have been harassing the whole entire town. Oh, it sure would suck if these guys... Oh, I... 